Coach, you guys uh, you know, fell behind early. How much did that kind of hurt your game plan as a run-oriented team? Well, you know what? We didn't. The, the explosive plays we didn't have. And uh, I felt like on Tuesday of last week, Wednesday, when we talked, uh, the recipe for this thing was we had to score touchdowns in the red zone, and I thought we had to be 50% or better on third down. Uh, we, we missed the third down by, I think, two or one. And then, uh, you know, we didn't get the field goal. And then uh, they got us on a zero blitz that one time, you know. That's two more opportunities, you know. Maybe that's 28 points. Maybe who knows how it changes the game in this thing. So that that, that wasn't the recipe for it. We didn't get that done. Benny got nicked up there in the second quarter. You had to come out. You guys ended up causing to go down and score. Was that kind of the turning point of the game right there? I don't I don't. I, I don't know that. I don't. I don't. I don't even remember that. You know, to be honest with you, just in terms of that, if that was a turning point of the game. I think there's a lot of things in, in a game when you go back and look. You know, I don't know if that. I don't think that was it. What does it say about Ben? That he's been able to do what he has the last two weeks, especially when the game goes out. He's still running hard. Yeah, you know, that, that's that's his nature. I mean, that, that's just who Benny Snell is. You know, he's a great competitor, and you know, we talked about it this week also about that. Uh, you know, great competitors, and you show up, and you, you, you have to compete in these games, and uh, any game, and I think he does in every game. You know, he loves this game, and, uh, you know, so he gives you his all.